Man, this track. I love this track so much. I'm glad it's in Mario Kart Tour. One of my favorite tracks of all time. Let me introduce you to Fire Rosalina. The newest variant of Rosalina. Her specialty is the Fire Flower. And it makes sense because in Super Mario 3D World, which this outfit was based off of, if you activate the Fire Flower on her, she turns into this. So what's my review of Rosalina's Ice World? I mean, I don't need to say it, okay? I love the detail, I love the track, I love everything about Rosalina's Ice World. Now, there are two areas in Rosalina's Ice World that has two different paths. I'm showing you both paths in each variant. And side note, each variant of Rosalina's Ice World is being played by Rosalina because Rosalina Tour, Rosalina's Ice World makes sense. <laughs> Now, there was also one other character I forgot to mention. If you see my Twitter page, I finally got her. Yes, I got Swimwear Rosalina. And it took me three freaking tours to get her. Same with Aurora Rosalina. But enough with that, onto the race. This race was pretty smoothly, except I might have messed up a couple a bit. Here's the other path, by the way. And the other path was the underwater section. Only because there's a landing that you have to hit in order to activate, in order to go to the ice, ice section. And here I got blued on the line. That's pretty cool. Anyway, on to the trick variant. As the name implies, this is the trick variant of Rosalina's Ice World. More trick ramps added into Mario Kart Tour. The only Rosalina I have that's three item slot is Halloween Rosalina. I, I'm serious. All Rosalinas, I actually have all the Rosalinas now. And Halloween Rosalina is the only character slash Rosalina I have that's three item slot. I feel like that's kind of weird. <laughs> Now, as you saw here, I got wrecked by Pauline and her super horn. Very unfortunate. Now, here I will show you the underwater section. Okay, but it was kind of tricky for me because you hit the trick. Uh, yeah, you hit the ramp and you automatically land on the ice block section. And so in order for me to go underwater, I have to do something to show you what the underwater section looks like in the trick variant. And here's the left side of the cave in the trick variant. It's just basically the same thing as the normal variant, but with more trick ramps. Let's see, what else? Oh yeah, the tier shop, token shop I meant. You can hit people with bananas and hit items on festive trees. Those are the only ways for you to gain green tokens. And here I pull a red shell frenzy in second. You don't see that often. <laughs> now here I did go underwater. I had to hit the ice box section. Because like I said, and here I got decimated by a penguin. And more trick ramps. And now here is the left side of the cave. It's just basically the same thing as the normal variant, but with one trick ramp. And here I got decimated by a lightning bolt made by Fire Rosalina. But I still managed to snag that first place. And now on to the reverse variant. The final variant. As the name implies, this is the reverse variant of Rosalina's Ice World. Now, there is one Rosalina that I have that is three item slots the others just don't make sense fire rosalina the characters that i have that are also three item slots is ice mario and toad mario kart 8 which toad mario kart 8 why is he three item slot i can see ice mario but 
Mario Kart Tour logic. <laughs> As you saw there, there was the right side of the cave in the reverse variant. Nothing to be added. And here they added a glider ramp. Something that was not in Rosalina's Ice World in Mario Kart 7. But no matter. And I decided to show you the underwater section first because I figured it might be a little bit more tricky to go underwater than hitting the ice section. Yeah. Made no sense, but my uh, something I make just doesn't make sense. More like something I say doesn't make sense. And now, here is the left side of the cave. Notice I sit in an opposite direction, opposite ways, because it is the reverse variant after all. And what I noticed about the track is that you can hit icicles for points, something that could be helpful to rack up those extra points. And as you saw, and as we're seeing here, I am gliding to the ice section, almost over the ice section if I had enough speed. But yeah, there's nothing else left to say about Rosalina's Ice World except. I love the track, I love the scenery. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.